Hi lovely people, this is Deisha here again with another video. In today's video, I will be washing my four month install. I usually keep my installations in for three months as a protective style. However, due to COVID-19, I have not been able to get my hair done. So I just kept it in an extra month. Hopefully my hair is not matted underneath. But um, after this wash, I'm definitely gonna have it removed because I don't wanna keep it in too long. All right, so I'm just starting off by braiding one side of the hair. Braiding it um, before I wash it makes it easier for it to be washed. It keeps it in place and prevents the hair from going all over the place. This hair is about two years old. I just wash it and reuse it until I can't anymore. Seal it with a rubber band just to keep it in place. So I'm just starting off doing the same thing to the other side, braiding it all the way down, and then I'm gonna secure it with a rubber band. As you can see, the hair is very greasy, so it's definitely in need of a wash. So here I have two little cute pigtails braided down. Under here, you can see I have a lot of buildup from the moisturizer that I use in my hair, also from the got to be which I use to tack down my lace. Can't wait to get in there and scrub that hair. I have a wide tooth comb or detangling comb. I have my shampoo that I use on my scalp in that applicator bottle. And this is regular shampoo and conditioner that I'll be using for the weave. And the silicone mix that I'll be using on top of the weave as like a deep conditioner. All right, so now I'm gonna turn on the shower. Make sure the water's not too hot. I've got my applicator bottle ready. Just gonna rinse my hair first, get it all wet. take my shampoo this is a shampoo that I mix myself I use that for my scalp I'm gonna scrub in there I'm gonna make sure that my hair is clean in all places get the front my edges the back of the, uh, the nape of my hair and also in the middle where the installation is sewed onto a little massager that I use on my scalp. I'm gonna rinse that shampoo from the scalp of my hair. So I usually shampoo my hair three times before conditioning. As you can see, the second time it lathers up nicely. I just took the regular store-bought shampoo and I used that on the weave. I'm gonna get in those crevices, get between those braids. I'm gonna take my massager and massage my scalp again. I'm gonna get that lace where the got to be glue was. Make sure that part is clean. And then I take my handheld shower and I rinse. Now I take my applicator bottle and I'm going to fill that up with my conditioner. This conditioner I use specifically on my real hair. Make sure every part of my hair is conditioned. And then I just take the regular store brand conditioner and I condition the weave. Since this hair is very long, I make sure that I use regular conditioner because it can be very expensive. My lace is clean. My scalp is clean. Gonna thoroughly rinse that out. Nice and sleek, manageable, no tangles, no knots. All right, so I just wrap my hair with a towel. Now I'm just gonna make sure it's detangled. And I'm gonna let this air dry. If you have a blow dryer, you can use the blow dryer as well, but i rather let my hair air dry because it's healthier for the weave. 
And then I'm gonna go in with my hair growth serum. And I use this on my real hair and on my real scalp only. Make sure to get those edges. And I use a leave-in conditioner. This leave-in conditioner, I just use it on my real hair. And also, I put a little bit on the weave as well. So after detangling and caring for my edges, I'm going to let this air dry for a couple of hours. So now I am completely dry. It's nice and smooth. Now I'm going to go on with this heat protecting spray being that I'm going to flat iron it straight. Like I said, I had this hair for a couple years now and this is how I am able to help take care of it so that I can reuse it. So I section out my hair, I'm detangling it again and I'm going one pass with the flat iron. I'm going to do a second pass with the flat iron and the comb together. I feel two passes are enough, it gets it straight the way I want it um, and it prevents it from getting damaged. As I get closer to the middle of the install, I like to make the parts thinner so that it's flatter on top. Alright, so this side is complete and straight in the way that I like, and it's on to the next. I'm just doing the same exact thing that I did on the other side to this side and now I am completely done I straighten both sides it looks very nice and sleek I usually wear it without um, laying the frontal only because I need to protect my edges like I said previously but when I go out I'll surely will be laying my frontal is nicely straightened so I'm gonna wrap my hair now just to make sure that I don't have to straighten it again I'm gonna pop on my hair tie and my hair is complete I'm definitely satisfied for months and it still looks great thanks for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe <laughs>